and tales for dark nights. The following performance is a first round entry in the Evil Idol competition, in which the winner of the contest will become a permanent member of the Chilling Tales for Dark Nights voice acting team. Listen to the entire performance, and if you'd like to see this particular contestant advance to the second round, which begins August 1st, simply click the thumbs up icon to vote in their favor. If you don't care for the performance, click the thumbs down icon instead. Thanks for listening and for participating, and good luck to all of our first round contestants. Just one of those naps. By DG Collins. Read here for the Evil Idol competition by Nicholas Garoff. In your dreams, a door will sometimes appear. And in the peculiar chaos of dreams, where you seem to act on a thought at the same moment you think it, you might find yourself stepping through the door. On the other side will be an endless and gloomy realm of twilight. The sky here is dark, while the ground is covered in a low, hanging grey mist, and just as in many other dreams, it feels both strange and familiar at the same time. There are also people here. They are shadowy figures shuffling about in mute silence, until your sudden appearance catches the attention of those nearby. They react swiftly, lunging towards you with frightening speed as the mist swirls out of their way. You freeze in alarm, but they push you aside in their mad rush, and you realize they aren't coming for you. They want the door. And indeed, as soon as one of them reaches it and it slips through, the door vanishes. The people who are left behind slowly disperse, to once again resume their aimless drifting. You open your mouth to ask questions. What's happening? Where is this? Why am I here? But the words die on your lips. The blank faces of these people hold no answers, and even if they did, it would hardly matter. Your memories have suddenly left you, and without memories, the person you were is gone. The self who was held together by a seemingly continuous string of thoughts and events has been interrupted. You're one of them now, one of the shadow people, who walk through the twilight with no purpose except this to find another door. So you wander, endlessly and without direction. A month passes, then a year, then a hundred years, or even a thousand. Perhaps there is no time here, or perhaps it runs in all directions, including backwards. There's no way to tell, for nothing ever changes in this place. Nothing except for the rare appearances of the doors. Then at long last it finally happens. A door appears, and this time you are the lucky one. This time you are the closest shadow person when someone new stumbles into the gloom. Quickly now, run! Run and shove and rush through the door, and... Your eyelids flutter. Your mind spins. What's happening? Where is this? Why am I here? But in the next instant, memories begin to connect. You may experience the tiniest flicker of confusion as they settle into place, a half-second of fearful uncertainty about whether these memories are really yours, or if they belong to someone else. But the sensation is gone almost before you notice it. You raise your head to blink at the unfamiliar surroundings, feeling sluggish and heavy. You shiver. You draw in a big, long breath. And then you're chuckling at yourself for sleeping so deeply that you could swear. You almost forgot who you are. Thanks for listening. If you haven't already, don't forget to cast your vote for this contestant via a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Thanks for voting and for spreading the word about Chilling Tales for Dark Nights and our first ever Evil Idol competition. Tune in August 1st, 2016 for the start of Round 2. Chilling Tales for Dark Nights.